ships have sailed from Hawaii. A huge misconception of being Hawaiian means going back to the loincloths, going back to the grass shacks. The idea of people being fascinated with Hawaii is, is similar to the idea of pe people being fascinated with heaven. When you look at Hawaiian chants and legends, there is so much going on, so far back. There are stories of golden ages that came and went. The knowledge of their land, sacred to them. At the dedication of a war heiau, you have a, a human sacrifice. If you had a big fat pig, that was supposed to go to the chiefs. That was the way things work. You drop something, step on the wrong spot, you're dead. People of New England saw themselves as God's people. And the foreign mission school was a jewel in the crown of the missionary field. The spirit is universal. It's not racial. The point was to come out here and create a Bible in the people's language. Places of worship and the idols were all destroyed. I like to reflect on the fact that it came out of from a place of good intentions. They had no plan to force the Hawaiians to speak the language differently. The catchphrase is that you hate the sin and love the sinner. He was a man of uncommon talents. Are we so different? I, I don't think so. Died this day, John Honolii, a minister of the Hilo Church. No missionaries were even alive at the time of the revolution. Aloha and resource management. Now everybody finding out the world is an island. <laughs>